All right, people, it's Sprite here, and today you are in for a tree. I don't know what I was doing in this game, but I wasn't missing. I know I say that a lot, okay, I know I say that a lot, but in this game, I wasn't, okay? I think in the whole streak, I missed like four shots, three or four shots for the whole gameplay. The whole game, I joined a little bit late, like 10 kills in, but just watch me go off. It is absolutely disgusting. It's like one of the most accurate games I've ever had on, in Call of Duty, ever. And it's my best gameplay on Infinite Warfare by far. It, my best streak. Spoiler alert, I don't even die. I go flawless the whole game. Obviously, that makes no sense if it was flawless for part of the game. But yeah, I'm just absolutely destroying. I'm so excited to show you guys this gameplay. I felt like I was locking onto people, just laser beaming people. The streak was beautiful. I got the Warden. I got Advanced UAV. I was running around, just ran out of bullets near the end as well. It was just intense so hope you all enjoy that as always drop a like if you do it is just it's beautiful okay it's beautiful so hope you guys had a great christmas so i'm going to talk while this is in the background but just you don't even have to listen to me if you don't want to just focus on the gameplay and the streak but i hope you all had a great christmas or a great holiday or break or whatever you celebrate hope it was a great time i had a nice christmas back at home living away from home now and it's nice to go back and have a catch up and just you know celebrate some good times and open some presents and give presents and stuff like that so it's really I don't know, it's just it's just a good time of year. It's great to just see family that I haven't seen in a while, or just have a catch up and, you know, see the look on their faces where you get them a gift that they weren't expected or just that they really wanted and stuff like that. I like to give gifts. I like to make other people happy. I don't know what it is this year. I really didn't want anything. I usually don't need anything now. I'm more about giving than receiving. I think I've just grown out of it, but I got some great presents from my family, uh, just some clothes and some shoes and whatever. Obviously, I picked a few of those out. I don't know if, that, if that's cheating. Is that cheating? for Christmas? I don't know, but it's really hard for them to have your taste in clothes, I guess you would say, so they just, they can't really risk it. They don't want to buy something that I don't like, so it's just a smarter way of doing it. Just something that they've paid for and can wrap up and just for me to write surprise when I've received it, obviously, because you got to do that. So, just things like that. My parents ended up getting me just a couple of other things, and they ended up getting me a watch, which I really didn't expect. I don't really care how much it costs or anything like that. It was just a great gesture. I really haven't owned a watch since I was a kid, and I just don't wear one because I feel like I just checked my phone, but now I've got one. I just feel more grown up, as weird as that sounds. And I was actually looking about buying a watch soon anyway, so to get a beautiful one for Christmas was a great idea. So uh, I'm really happy with the gifts I gave this year. I tried to make it more about meaning and a little bit of personal side to it. Obviously, I get the normal stuff, the, like gifts that they definitely want, certain techie things, gadgets, whatever it may be. That's, that's what I do. So this year, there's a couple of things that have happened within our family that I wanted to just, you know, touch up on with gifts and stuff like that. And the one that sparked the most emotion, and I don't know if I should be happy or sad that I did this, but my grandparents' dog that I've known since I was a kid, like I grew up with this dog, it passed away of old age, like a few weeks before Christmas, horrible time. You know, it's really upsetting because it's just, it's more a family. After that many years of just being there and with you, I'm sure you guys can understand if you've had a family pet that's unfortunately passed away, it's a horrible time. Time. And I just thought of this as like a physical way for them to remember him and all the memories they've had And I got him like a garden sculpture They love their garden stuff and I got him a sculpture of the breed of dog and as soon as she opened it I got my grandma to open it. Uh, she cried so I like I feel terrible that I you know I sparked that and brought those feelings back but at the same time once that's passed I think it's just a nice addition to the garden and they can see it and they remember the good times Obviously, I, f I don't know if I should feel bad that I, <laughs> that I made my grandma cry But I just uh, you know, I just tried to get those kind of gifts this year, things with meaning rather than just like things that anybody could buy. I wanted to make sure it was something a bit more personal. So anyway, I don't know why I just rambled about that for the uh, for the whole entire gameplay here, but I hope you enjoyed it. Ended up with a juggernaut, unstoppable streak, whatever it's called. I hate calling it a juggernaut streak. It just doesn't sound good. I want to call it a nuclear. I want to call it the new nuclear streak, but I can't because obviously there's a nuke in the game. So I don't know. It's uh, it's a bit of a bit of a pain, but hope you guys enjoyed that streak. Flawless, 44-0. Absolutely beautiful. Picked up a NV4 at the end there. And if you want to see me red gun, there you go. See what my red gun shot's like. I thought it was pretty crisp for that game there. But that's going to do it for today's video. Hope you all enjoyed. Hope you had a great celebration. Hope you have a happy new year celebration too if you celebrate that. If not, hope you have a great early night to get away from the fireworks. But thank you guys for watching. Please leave a like if you enjoyed. And I'll see you all tomorrow. Type beast highly likely to bite me and try to high five me, but I just give them high threes. Cause y'all don't get to touch me on this shit, sue me if you got an issue.